this situation is somewhat old, but I just had to comment on it. So we all know what a Karen is by now. That's the new generation's word for basically an entitled and deranged human being. But I tell y'all one thing, this lady in this story needs to have her picture in the dictionary as the example. So basically, she claims that a UPS worker didn't want to deliver her package, but it actually turns out that the package was just too heavy and he told her that he'll be back once he has the proper equipment. Now, I'm reading through the comments and there was one or two UPS drivers that said, okay, why would you go to her home, let her know you had her item, and then say you'll be back. You know, I understand that aspect as well, but I feel like she was doing too much. This is... Driver Look at this lady who has my stuff. He won't give it to me. I paid for it. Can you send him? I'm under his truck. I'm yes, he is, and I will not let I'm him. I'm trying leave. to leave, and she's under my truck. I'm laying under his truck, and I will not let him leave. What is the address? Oh. Man, that's not safe. Somebody can hit you. You need to get out under there. I'm, uh, well, I'm in front of the gate, but I live in B10. I'll wait for my supervisor. I won't leave, but get out of there. You're going to get hurt. Yes, it is. Go to the end of my staff. But I'm not going to let him leave. This is ridiculous. Because if he's going to try to leave, he'll get back under. The only way I won't be safe is if he tries to drive away. Okay. Thank you. Hey, the police really, she's really controlling them. Can you go ahead and sit on the sidewalk, not my truck, please? I'm not hurting your truck at all, sir. Just, okay, don't sit on it. I'm not sitting, I'm standing. You want to get out and take a look, too? I stand much better than I sit. I have a compressed spine. All right. This lady slid under the truck like she was tucking herself into bed. And while it's funny on the surface, I think she should have went to jail for at least 48 hours for wasting time and resources because I'm sorry, something needs to happen to those people that call 911 for petty shit like this. And then you have a bunch of Karen Juniors co-signing her antics and defending it. But that's to be expected because assholes unite in situations like this. But I want y'all to comment below and tell me what y'all think about the situation. Do you think the UPS worker was actually at fault and she was justified? Let me know how you feel and I'm going to catch y'all in the next one.